NBC Sunday Night at the Movies will return following these messages. It's been six years, six years since the Fury, six years since David Banner was pushed too far. Now they've stolen his woman and ruined his career. This time, they've really gotten under his skin. You wouldn't like me when I'm angry. He's mean, green, and pumped up for his greatest challenge ever. Bill Bigsby and Lou Ferrigno in The Incredible Hulk return Sunday. This is a Newswatch 6 update. Hello, I'm Rob Wiles. A tragic bus accident today in Kentucky. 27 are killed. We'll have that story for you. In Waco, a warning to watch your cholesterol. Lynn Martin will fill us in on that. And it was the day to remember slain police officers in Temple. We'll tell you more. In sports, the Mavericks take another step into the NBA playoffs. We'll have that story. And Mike Hernandez will tell us if we can expect rain this week. All the news, weather, and sports coming up on Newswatch 6. I don't know about you, but I don't drink and drive. In fact, I don't drink at all. I don't have to. First, get a job that pays a million bucks an hour. Work a couple of hours, retire. Now comes the hard part, holding on to your money. I suggest you eat at Judge's Chicken. Big pieces of crispy chicken that don't cost much. That's always good. Say, if you find one of them million bucks an hour jobs, let me know, okay? <laughs> Get two big pieces, legs and thighs, fries and drink for just $1.99. You know, Auto Shack customers are pretty special. I mean, they take great pains to do a job just right, so they know exactly what they want. That's why we carry so many parts and guarantee over 42,000 of them for as long as you own your car. It's also why we price them so low, because you got to admire a man who will tackle a job like putting in his own water pump or starter. And you got to give a guy like that exactly what he wants, the right part at the best price. Dale Caffey means sports, weeknights at 6 and 10, right here on Channel 6. The case of the lady in the lake continues. Starring Raymond Burr, Barbara Hale, and William Catt.